Yeah, I got it. Roll with it. Ladies and gentlemen, we back at it like we never left at it. Before it was WrestleMania, now it's SummerSlam. Before it was New York, now it's LA. I'm DJ Slab One, represent Q93 in the world. It's 504 to the music. The great David Sandler. Hello? Just wanna let you know, as we set off camera, my bag is washed. So you already washed it. <laughs> washed it. By the way, testing one two and my audible. Yes, you are audible. Oh, very good. Very good. Come good. closer, Flash. Make sure he's audible. Come closer. Okay. Oh, of course. Excellent. Excellent. We're doing a video. We're shooting back to New Orleans. Wow. No problem. Yeah. All right. You hold the key in your hand. Your destiny is here. Yes, this is the new, improved, and sandalized Money in the Bank briefcase. Well, might, might have touched it, I apologize. Uh, no, it is made of the finest ostrich skin, so it, it's actually quite, uh, quite durable. Believe it or not. You see it, huh? It floats. It floats. Yes. <laughs> that was uh, an unfortunate, uh, what, two weeks ago? My man, yes. man, the son of a son of a plumber. Yes, yes. He did that to us. He threw your money in the bank. You got to keep it clean. He's washed now. I might just read the mic. He threw your money in the bank uh, and briefcase into the Gulf of Mexico. Yes, about that. Are you aware that in recent days, a shark, a 12-foot tiger shark to be exact, it, it was, was shark pulled man. out of the Gulf of Mexico in Corpus Christi, Texas? Did he have the money in Literally the bank? Literally feet from where I had jumped in to retrieve the original money in the bank briefcase. I'm sure you could be the shark. I am the survivor of a potential shark attack. <laughs> you think so? And due to my act of heroism, the Discovery Channel has named an entire week Shark Week in honor of me. So that was you. Yeah. Are you good to roll with that? All right. SummerSlam is this weekend. Do you plan to use this? First of all, before I you answer that, will you be uh, a man, the son of a son of a poop? The grandson of a poop. Oh, sorry about that. Okay. Yes, uh, I will because, again, we had money in the bank. Uh, about a month ago, which was several WWE superstars all competing for one prize. Right. And Cody and I said going into it, the best man will win, and the best man did win. Now, if I can beat Cody and a plethora of other WWE superstars one on one, Cody will not be a problem. You're very confident. The case is not lying. You've kind of acquired that underlying deceptive funny type. We're not going to get into that. A win is a win. We don't care how many. A win is a win is a win. Yes. Yeah, right. So, we're predicting Damien Sandow the winner at some point. Yes, we are. Are we predicting Damien Sandow to cash that in at some point? Well, if I was a war general, would I reveal my battle plan? Uh, not exactly, but if you're a war general, you could either see an air man, maybe a man. So, if I said no, meaning actually yes to the sway people, Thinking that I was telling the truth. You know, with you, the truth is See, a dishonest man you can always trust to be dishonest. However, an honest man like myself may dissuade people from time to time, thus creating that gray area, so to speak. Like I said, a, 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 a dishonest man. Which is you? <laughs> you, have, you have some kind of a twist, sir. Uh, no, sir. It's just, you know, it's early in the morning. I apologize. You know, this part here. All right. Let's talk about <laughs> <laughs> when. Well, we're actually, uh, let's talk about this elbow, man. The oh, yes. elbow of disdain. Yes. I, I, I'm, a, I'm a fan. I'm a real fan. Could, okay. you, could you demonstrate as far as Yes. Uh, well, the elbow of disdain, uh, actually called the Cupido Acquies, named the Latin name, because once again, I'm always trying to educate people. Right. Uh, that, <clears throat> contrary to what most half would believe, is not just a regular elbow. Right. Oh, no, See, has, there have been several has. members of the Sandow family uh, that have been orthopedic surgeons, <laughs> have studied the physiology of the, elbow. Of the body, <laughs> elbow, exactly where to place it, as well as members of the Sandow family who have studied physics, which is why I deliver the elbow in a standing position and turn, which is that half rotation which coordinates with the Earth's gravitational and allows me to deliver a maximum damage. You know what I mean? It's like a warm up thing. Yes, it's one, two, the body follows, and I just let gravity take over, and there it is. You heard it here first. 
the elbow of this thing. One of my favorite moves in the WWE. Thank you. Ladies and gentlemen, Damien Sandow. Sorry, it was a pleasure. Absolutely. Absolutely. Absolute SummerSlam is this weekend. Please, Cox Cable in New Orleans, get it. WrestleMania is in New Orleans. Next year, will you be able to catch that in before or before? Back to that question again, right? Before, after, perhaps during, who knows? Who knows? Ladies and gentlemen, the great Damon Sandow with the elbow. Well, do the elbow. Like, like, do the. Would you mind? Can I? Can I? Yeah, yes. One. Yes. Two. Three. 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 Jump. There we go. Bam! It's Q93, baby. DJ Slab One. Damon Sandow. Summer Slam 13. WWE. Thank you, sir. You're welcome. Yes.